thousands of children. John Pertwee was the astronomical aristocrat. He was the Time Lord. His unique talents made him a star long before he entered the TARDIS. But as the third Doctor Who, he became the most popular. And after four years of time travelling, he established himself as something of a cult figure. It's a very complicated thing, time, Joe. Once you've begun tampering with it, the oddest things start happening. John Pertwee's acclaimed version of Doctor Who was a role in stark contrast to the comedy for which he'd been known. In reality, he was dismissive of Daleks. He said they were put together with a sink plunger, an egg whisk and tennis balls and said they were just ridiculous. Daleks! Those conventions won't be the same without him there. They won't be the same for the Doctor Who fans who he has been... The who, they have been devoted to him and he's devoted himself to them in return. He'll be very sadly missed. He was a great man. I mean, I can definitely say that I was in the company of a great man. And he made me laugh so much. From the dandy doctor to old turnip head. Playing Wurzel Gummidge gave Pertwee yet another opportunity to display his mastery of mimicry and dialect, delighting millions of children. And turning out for a children's party was never a problem for him. I'd rather dance with Aunt Sally. He quietly admitted he rather enjoyed being a cult figure. Colin Baker, News at 10. More news still ahead.